Hello, this is Amanda from the future, and I'm here to just recap where we are so far. So we traveled from Michigan to Des Moines, Iowa, where we stopped for the night at a very unfortunate choice. We made it to Iowa. It's pretty. It was a little dingy, but the worst part was that the bathroom smelled like cigarettes and the walls were paper thin so we could hear everything all night long and the dogs were barking so we did not sleep. And when Dan and I got there, we sat on the bed and this giant spider crawled out from underneath the sheets. I don't think we slept last night. It was so noisy here. We were gonna leave at 9 a.m. It is now 7 a.m. and we're just going because we've been up since five. So here's to day two. So we packed up, we left, and we made our way to Cheyenne, Wyoming. Wyoming was so much more comfortable. Then we got up bright and early to make our way over to Utah. We arrived in Salt Lake City and did the Ensign Peak hike, which led to this really stunning view of the entire city of Salt Lake. Then I took the dogs for an evening stroll to the capital. We visited Antelope Island, which was absolutely gorgeous. It was so windy that Mia almost got blown away and she was so scared. So Dan sat with her so that she would feel better sitting in his arms rather than having to fight for her life walking around. I mean, look at that view though. It was absolutely incredible, especially at sunset. I like to make Jessie do photo ops with me. She's not a fan, but look how cute we are. We're so cute together. On our way out, we were lucky enough to drive by a herd of bison. And for Dan and I, this is what we travel for. We love to watch wildlife. And so this was such a treat because they were right by the road. So we were able to stop our car and watch them and there were just the two of us there alone. And so this was a real treat to end our stay in Salt Lake. On our way to Reno, we decided to stop at the Bonneville Salt Flats. It's right off the highway and I'm so glad we made a pit stop there because it's just miles and miles of this salt floor. It's really worth seeing. And that's all you're gonna get to see from Reno. <laughs>
We were there for one night and did nothing except for sleep in the hotel. So here we are off to California next stop. See you then.